This is a painting by Jan Steen, and it depicts the card players. It was painted around about 1660. The great works of Rembrandt, Vermeer, Peter de Hoog are all being created around this time. And Jan Steen is very much part of that. We're drawn into this picture by the young woman who's seated at the table holding cards in her right hand and the ace of hearts in her left. And she's looking out of the picture at us. She's inviting us to join the party. Opposite her at the table is a well-dressed young man. He is almost certainly being cheated by everyone here. He's being proffered a glass of wine to soften him up by a young man with a pointed nose who is, as we so often see with Jan Steen, a caricature of the artist's own features. The dog on the floor is there for a very good reason. In Dutch 17th century paintings, the dog is always an emblem of fidelity as well as an emblem of wakefulness. He's fast asleep, which shows that all of this can go on. What we have here is so theatrical. This picture encapsulates so much of what we love and admire in Dutch 17th century genre painting. The fine painting, the caricatural element, the fully realized interior, the wonderful still life details, beautiful understanding of texture. The understanding of light in this picture is so sophisticated that the sword casts two shadows, which suggest that there are two light sources from outside the picture. That's an immensely sophisticated thing to do. And yet, with all this refinement, the faces of the characters, particularly the man offering the wine glass and ciliary figures, are painted with incredible rapidity and freedom. It's a very important picture. It's one of the, the best paintings by Jan Steen to come on the market for a long time. Mm -hmm.